so we definitely want to be able to advertise this thing. So. So are we? So is yeah. this this is saved even though you can kind of sort of see my nipples? When it flashes. When I when I process it, when I process it, this will almost look like it's black. Oh. I'm going to process the video way down. Oh, okay. I'll do the pictures hot, but the video will actually be way down, so it will look almost like a black top. It won't be transparent at all. Okay. But it's just enough that other little YouTubers will be like. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> Yeah, again, just got to have that little bit of tease that kind of <laughs> makes people a little bit crazy. Hi, YouTubers. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got. Let's see what we got cooking here. That's perfect. Yeah. All right. Okay. Yep, and we're actually going to do shoes. That's the scary part. Yeah, she's doing some serious shoes for you there, dude. Yeah, I don't know about shoes, though. <laughs> so few people have shoes. You mean he won't bring them? Well, he doesn't well, usually I don't ask usually do it. shoes. Yeah. I'll hold that for a second while I go right for that hole. Get that portfolio shot. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, no, it's also to make sure that I've got the light positioned right. Oh, that's right. Yeah. You don't have the square lights up. So no. You're not going to get the square on. No, what I'm getting is a nice streak down the side. There you go. Yeah, but no, the cool part though about making the YouTube videos is that basically then once we've got it, you can just take it anywhere. So if you want to like post this up on Facebook, it will still meet the Facebook terms and conditions and all the rest of it. Sweet. So they can flag it all they want. Mm-hmm. Yes, I've gotten very, very, very comfortable with Facebook <laughs> terms and conditions. I don't know, did you see the shoot we did with Morgan? Um, uh, was it with latex? No, it was nude, not nude. Nude, not nude. Nude, not nude. Oh yeah, you told me about that one. Yeah. Then I looked it up. Yeah. That was actually a lot of fun because people actually started flagging them, and uh, Facebook's just like, no, 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 we're good. See, he's signing his own. The terms, the terms. Yeah. You're gonna have fun clubbing in that skirt and going to events in that skirt. No kidding. <laughs> You can put that Sorry. with like a silk top and the, the mm -hmm. textures are going to just be awesome. Yeah, when we were wrapping this up to, uh, when we were, um, actually had Carlina Gore try this on Oh, first, yeah. Oh, just yeah. to make sure. Just for simpler <laughs> signs. Yeah, and she actually put on underwear, so on, on the black. Uh -huh. So we put on this day glow green underwear, uh -huh. which just made that black really pop off. <laughs> so if you do uh, wear these, um, definitely do the day glow stuff. Yeah, if you want to wear this spanky dress, you can wear a day glow. Hold that for a second. It, and it's hilarious. Can I see what they look like? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just keep on putting my face oh. the right way and stuff. Ooh. Oh, I like that one. Sweet. Oh, yeah, shiny. See, I'm really trying to get that. Yep. That big light's just giving me all that light along the side. Sweet. So again, I'm really trying to run it. So that yeah, that's why I made high. sure you didn't have any dry spots on yeah. the booty. Otherwise, it will really show up, especially when you have that. And and have the has the site been using your stuff on their uh, catalog still? Yes. Cool. Yes. So you'll probably end up using catalog. Actually, one of them, um, one of the models, Kiara, from the shoot. Kiara over, LeBlanc. Yeah, she's actually using some of the pictures for uh, a show that she's doing over in Bellevue. So she's got what some. Kind of show is that? She's got some um, modeling show that she's doing. So I took a picture of her with the uh, captain's jacket. She did her first latex shoot ever, and it was just kind of fun to actually watch her. How see how she's using it to kind of promote herself. And I guess she does a lot of stuff with Zululi. 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 So. Just kind of fun watching her actually yeah, use those really pictures. Is entertaining. And the cool part is that she's actually doing all the right things. She's doing all the credit. So she's credited in me, she's credited in Marjani, which is actually really kind of fun to have that happen. Sweet. So, yeah, no, she's fun to work with. She uh, took up my offer to meet me at a Starbucks and we chatted about freelance modeling mm -hmm. for like an hour. So. Yeah. Yeah, she's a sweet girl. Yeah, no, she is. She's, uh, it was just kind of funny because she was like really nervous about latex because she was like thinking I was going to 
do all the collar cuffs and chains things. And, uh, and masks and everything. Yeah. So I think she was just really surprised that we were coming at it from a uh, more of a fashion-y statement. Hold that. So I think she actually had a lot of fun. Perfect. <laughs> all right. You're going to like that one. I do. I like the ear Oh, sweet. Yep. Do you want to do any like uh, implied topless ones? Not for this. Okay. <laughs> no. To be real honest. Again, it's more about doing the whole thing so that we can do all the things. Okay, so we're going for full body. You okay? Yeah. Okay. Oops, sorry. Gotta get her balance. <laughs> there we go. I want to see That's you try it. to even stand on those shoes. I'm going to do the other way. All right. Three. Got it. That's <laughs> <laughs> why he started with like Renaissance festivals and cosplay and yeah. stuff. He knows how to do the action shots. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Cause, cause seriously, man, when people are moving, they're really moving. You got some good shots of the jousting, which is not easy. No. <laughs> Horses move fast. <laughs> Horses move fast. There's hair. There's expression. There's people trying to shove a pike through a ring. <laughs> and then, I don't know, have you ever been to SacraCon? The big no, one? I haven't. So it's the big cosplay convention here. And what's kind of fun though is because they're all 14 year olds. And you remember the kind of energy you had as a 14 year old, right? You're like <laughs> bouncing all over the place. Yeah. So trying to get the kids to actually pose well. It can be kind of interestingly problematic at times. Hold that. Yeah. I'll just push the butt out just a little bit more. Oh, there you yeah. go. There you go. That way we get that nice. Let me show you one. Brown shine. Is because when you're doing that, uh -huh. you get that nice. Oh yeah. Pinch on it. Uh huh. And then the the bottom part kind of like uh -huh. lifts too. Yep. That's hot. <laughs> That's why it's actually a fun fabric. Yeah, exactly. It's amazing what you can do with it. It's a lot of fun to play around with because a lot of people just don't. And of course, he sees it as a lighting challenge. Yeah, it is because <laughs> you're trying to get, get not burn someone out. Mm -hmm. But you still want to get that whole thing across. The shininess. Yeah, and that's why so much of it's so dark, right? You get all this dark light around it. You have that really dark background. So shooting it against shiny white background, painful, but comes out really, really good because no one else is in the space. Yeah. Which is nice when you actually find something that not a whole lot of people are doing. And I'm popular in Germany now. Gotta <laughs> <laughs> love the Germans. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it is. This is funny. Okay, that's it. Okay. Swapped out. Sweet.